think we've got a take on the pike float, guys. Well, we've just had a take. We're fishing. Wow. And a bite, guys. Yes, was just packing up. M25. <laughs> hey all, how you doing? Welcome back to the channel. Today you find us after <laughs> sitting on the M25 for ages at a reservoir. Now I've never fished a reservoir in my life. 50 years of fishing, never fish one. So yeah, it's a bit hit and miss. We've just kind of rocked up and um, we're gonna see what happens. So uh, we're on the feeder rods and we've got a pike rod we'll stick out a bit later on. Show the tackle and the setups a little bit later on. Um, but the target species today, roach, perch, bream, anything really that take a feeder rod. So thank you all for watching. Fingers crossed, you never know, we might catch something. If not, another one for the black bank, but hey. Um, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Let's crack on. See you in a bit. Quick look at where we are. The reservoir. What have we got? Two feeder rods. Yeah. We got some lovely worms. Yeah, and we got some very patriotic red, white, and blue. Oh, and yellow maggots. Well guys, we've moved, um, we've come up to the end. It was uh, hard work fishing back down there. The wind was blowing up, making it hard to film. So uh, we've come up the end. I don't think we got the depth of water that we had back down there, but it has been quite warm. So fingers crossed, let's hope we get into something. I'm gonna set up a pipe rod now. I think we've got a take on the pike float, guys. Look at that. That is going the wrong way. Let some line out. We can have. We've got. I think we've got a take on the pike float, guys. Something has picked that up. Stop. There we go. We've got a bob. Stop and turn it. Come on, take it. Something definitely had that then. Are you stopping in the turn in it? What are you doing? I don't want to hit it too soon. Teeth marks in the mackerel. Damn. Let it go. Well, one little run on the dead bait so far, and nothing on the feeders. We keep trying. Okay, guys, we got to, we got to take on the on the float. <laughs> Coming in towards us. Has he stopped to eat it? Do I hit it? Is it still there? Just brought it in. Looks like it's still there. Should I hit it? I'm quite inexperienced at pike float fishing, but I'm going to wind down and. 
Oh, nope. Yeah, fucking. Oh. Lost me bike. Hey, well, we've gone back to the van and we've swapped over some of the gear. Um, we put the feeder rods away and all the coarse tackle and uh, got a nice comfy seat and we're gonna have a go at some pike on the bottom. Uh, we got some dead baits. We did have a couple of takes on the float, um, but the float keeps on, the wind's changed and the, and the float's getting pushed towards us. So we're gonna have a go on the bottom. Fingers crossed. Hopefully, you never know, we might catch a jack or two. Well, I think we've got our first knock on the far rod. You gonna go again? Definitely just add a little four or five bleeps. Oh, come on. Take it. You know you want to. Definitely something farting around with it. Well, we've just had a take. Yes, we're in. Awesome. That was on the tiny tiny a little roach and a single size four it's probably a little jack doesn't feel massive yeah little jack in the net baby We go first little jack of the day caught on the little tiny look at that pops out the little tiny hair rigged roach there he is little tiny jack there he is little tiny jack caught on a hair rigged tiny little roach. Let's put him back. Okay mate. There he goes. See you later buddy. Little roach. These are the little roach that I'm using. Just a hair rig. It's so cold they're not bloody, it's so cold they're not defrosting. What I'm doing. Oh, they're frozen solid. What I'm doing is hair rigging on hair like that. got uh, an 18 pound wire trace and then I knock this knot onto a little hair. This is what we were using in a video for this is what we were using in a video for or a method we were using in a video for Xander Old Berry Hill. There's a little bit of twig pulling that down through There we go, a little hair rigged, there we go, a little hair rigged roach. I've done the business on that little jack.
they all excited and it was the swan. Oh, a lovely beautiful swan and it just came and sat right in my lines. You're very beautiful mate but please don't sit on my lines. I've got no bait today, it's just little fish. My missus keeps telling me to stop singing Wonderwall to her. I said maybe. <laughs> that joke in the video. It's a big old fella that one. Just seems to have adopted me like most animals do when I'm fishing. Wow. And you're a pretty boy. Yes you are. Hello bye guys. Yes, that's bigger. That's definitely bigger. Yes, taking drag. God was over there chucking a the lure. Oh, yes. That's a fish. That's a good one. And this was on the tiny, 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 tiny little roach again. Oh, it's a good fish. Yes, that's a good fish. Come on, baby, over the net you come. Yes, that is it. Much better than the last one. On a tiny, tiny little roach. Fish are about. 80 centimeters, probably about five, six pounds, I would have thought. There we go. Another pike caught on. A little tiny. Singles. There you go, baby. See you later, darling. Awesome. The small boats totally out fishing the big boats at the moment. I might put the other rod on the small bait and have them both out in a minute. Two. Good stuff. Hey, well, not too bad for our first time on a reservoir. Um, shame we didn't get into any of the 
roach and perch and bream on the feeder. Hey, at least we've got a couple of pike on the lead um, on the Xander tactics. So um, yeah, not a blank. Two pike, probably two pound and maybe six and a half, possibly. So all good. As always, thank you very much for watching. It's really appreciated. If you'd like to give us a thumbs up, or even if possibly a subscribe, that would be awesome. That would just help our little channel just get a little bit bigger. Was just packing up. Awesome. I was just packing up. And we got another bad boy. Looks like the hook's come out in the net. Oh no, he hasn't. There we go. Barbless hooks, man. <sighs> there we go, number three for the day. Yes, baby. Number three. Okay, I'm going to try and do a water release for this one. <laughs> would you believe it fantastic three pike that's my best in a session ever <laughs> i know it's not much to some of you guys out there but to me that's fantastic <laughs> oh my days three pike in one session awesome i was actually just in the middle of packing up there put me <laughs> everything away pretty much apart from the rods and uh, off it went so happy bunny <laughs> yes fantastic once again thanks for watching it's really appreciated oh you got me you got me i gotta learn my bike editing skills but hey it's, it's worth it thanks again for watching cheers bye